Hello guys, me Carl Santos aka Happy Carl and I5 and I have some great news on my YouTube channel. I officially reached my 100th subscriber from Glow FN. So I gotta give a shout out to him. So he made this 100th subscriber so memorable on my YouTube channel, which is Happy Carl and I5 because as you can see in my uh, YouTube channel name, I'm a Chase Elliott and a Kyle Larson fan, big time. So, and they both drive for Hanley Motorsports. So, where should I start on this, on my journey? So, on this uh, hot, sunny day in the summer during Darlington Throwback Weekend in 2015. I decided to start my own YouTube channel and it's been six great years, I'm telling you. And I would have never thought I have a hundred subscribers. So so keep it up everybody. Whether it's from the NASCAR community, the Hendrick Motorsports community, or whether you are Kyle Larson or Chase Elliott fan, for example. So all I can say is you guys are my favorite, favorite subscribers, I'm telling you. And what kept, what's gotten me to getting a lot of these YouTube followers is the NASCAR Weekly Podcast. So, so every Wednesday, I sit in my room, watch the 8 p.m. episode from... 8 to 10 p.m. Watching Darian, Danny B, Eric S. Deep, I believe, and Jared Lumber. Just, they talk NASCAR all the time, and I believe they're the greatest journalist, and should I say for Jared, a historian, I'm telling you. That's why... If you subscribe to my channel or even watch NASCAR Weekly Podcasts, you should subscribe to my channel by clicking the like button and commenting if you feel like it. So those are my suggestions if you want to keep following me for a long time and just follow 10, 10 years of just following NASCAR. And that's all I can say. So... So, I want to talk about the Homestead Miami race because I thought Kyle Larson had it in the bag, but his teammate William Byron had a strong car all day, got stage points in both stage one and two, and never looked back. He just flew on by, got a, had a five second lead or margin of victory, and then Tyler Reddick came out of nowhere and have second from both Larson and Truex and to get a surprising run. That's all. So I hope Tyler Randick he'll get his win. You know, I gotta give him a pat on the back. And let's see, 2015 was when I founded my YouTube channel. 2016 was me recording NASCAR races on TV. Whether it's from Fox or NBC, I'd say. And then 2017 was when I, being a Kyle Larson fan was just amazing, you know? It was from there on to 2021, I just kept uploading YouTube videos after YouTube videos, and I found a passion for doing it, you know? And I don't make money to do it. Because my parents don't want me to get a job doing YouTube full time and just, you know, breaking the bank, you know. And then basically, there, there on, I do Xbox games, which has racing genres, 
basketball and football genres and sometimes a little bit of Halo, Assassin's Creed, which I don't like, but I might have posted it on my playlist. And then some Watch Dogs, you know, just to have some fun and go on an adventure, you know. So, that's random. Those are random video games I play, but during my free time, and this was awesome. That's a milestone I would have never reached after six long years, but hey, I earned my 100th YouTube subscriber in Glow FN. So, okay. congratulations. So, I mean, so if you follow NASCAR or my YouTube channel, share share a comment, give a thumbs up button, and just what are your thoughts of me reaching my 100 subscribers? So that's where you share your comments. So I got nothing to say about how I reached my 100 subscriber. You know, so I make a happy con knife five. Y'all have a great good evening and peace out.